welcome back to my channel it's your girl Nats, and I hope everyone is happy healthy and doing okay all right guys so I don't know if you remember when I did my um like Japanese clothes try on haul when I told you that I need to clean my closet out get rid of some old clothes put up the new clothes and all of that stuff today's the day because since doing that haul maybe like a couple weeks ago I still have not started wearing my clothes because they're not up in my closet and I wanted to do this exact video for you guys when I'm putting them up in there so today's the day we're going to be cleaning out on my closet hanging up all the new clothes getting rid of old clothes and all of that stuff so if you want to see me purge my closet then keep on watching but before we head into the video, of course, we have to do our Nassificent Fam shout out. So let's get right into that. Biggest congratulations to the Nassificent Fam commenter of the week. As usual, thanks for watching and commenting. Now, guys, if you're wondering just how you can get a shout out, all you have to do is watch and leave a comment on this week's video. Also, for extra entries, all you have to do is share a screenshot of this week's video to your IG stories. Remember to tag me and that is it. Now guys, back to the video. Okay guys, welcome back. So, let us just get this closet started out. I am going to be taking every single piece of clothing out of my drawers, out of my closet, all of that stuff, laying them on the bed, try to figure out if I am going to need them, if I won't need them, all of that stuff, and get them the hell out, all right? So, let me just show you quickly what we are working with today. This is what it looks like inside of there. In this closet, I mostly have work clothing and then i have some drawers down there drawers down there all kinds of stuff that i already had labeled so like my belts are in those socks are in those undershirts are in those like rugs and hats i bought this dresser or chest of drawer kind of thing to do some more sorting out of clothes i have a bunch of clothes back there need to get sorted out i also have these three drawers here and i have clothes that i usually wear in the house in those two drawers so we need to sort them out so let's us just get into that all right you guys so actually i guys many times that I am a pen and paper kind of girl so in this book I actually have how I want to organize my clothing all right I need a drawer for undershirts I need a drawer for my bras and bralettes and tights and all of that stuff but the first thing is that I want to clear out two of the drawers there for only clothes that I wear in the house um tops and dresses in one oh and guys a tip like for us instead of using like canfa balls because in jamaica we have something by the name of canfa balls that the older people used to put in our clothes right to smell good but it kind of smells old so what i actually do is just i just take our bath soap and put them in our clothes so instead of like putting them up in the bathroom i just pull them and throw them in our clothes and the clothes smell nice so that's a tip if you want to use it sorting out my clothes some of the clothes that i normally are used to wear 
out like going not casual just going out on the road when i have a piece that i do not want to wear on the road anymore i transfer them to my yard clothes or house clothing so for example this blouse i used to wear it out nice blouse but i do not want to wear it out anymore and i don't think i want to get rid of it just yet so i'm transferring it to clothes that i actually wear in house or like to film videos and so on so key tip if you want to like if you have a clothing piece that you do not want to throw out but you don't necessarily want to wear it for what you bought it to wear then you could always do that all right you guys so this is what i have so far i have this drawer right here with only my yard clothes or house clothes tops and dresses at the back if the camera could just go up there right so dresses and blouses and then in this one i only have my yard bottoms so bottoms that i would wear in the house only so as you can see i do not have much bottoms but i do have a lot of tops and a lot of dresses so now we are going to tackle all of this pile that you are seeing on the bed we have a mixture of work clothes and uh going out clothes so like casual outing kind of clothes here that i need to put in the closet because originally all of my uh going out blouses and tops and so on we're in a drawer and i only used to hang up the dresses but now i'm going to put everything inside of the closet so let's do that shall we guys these are all my work clothing just work clothes alone this pile right here is a mixture of clothes between work clothes and clothes that i wear out those on the hangers are actually only work clothes and then i still have dresses that i wear out and then of course i have more clothing like in these pieces down there and in drawers down there so that is what i'm going to be sorting out no what i'm going to do is i'm going to be changing the hangers so i do want like a cohesive look kind of thing for my closet so i want to change out the colored hangers to all black velvet hangers so that is what we're going to be doing while we sort Oh, I knew you would go back You must be missing me so bad When you left, you said that I don't deserve you But I can see that you don't want to lose what we had these are the hangers that i bought on amazon japan i bought a box of 100 velvet hangers so if you have clothes that are usually falling like from the hangers and stuff because they're slippery velvet hangers is the way to go i will link these or similar ones to these on amazonus.com so you can grab some for love yourself me, just love me harder have no mercy on me tell me louder a good clean out when your floor looks like this and your bed is shrinking so guys i put together all my work clothing in the closet as you can see i do want to buy better hangers for these i see adam with some pant rack that i think i want to buy for my skirts 
just so everything can be leveled like these are and I don't have like craziness happening here and then the others are symmetrical but i have done them in order so i have like my jackets pants and skirts dresses short uh long sleeve blouses short sleeve blouses and then spaghetti strap way down at the end down there so that is how i've been arranging them so far so now i'm going to actually sort out all of my church clothes and all of my um going out dresses and so on and hang up like my going out blouses and so on from that pile over there so yeah still on it <laughs> I have been organizing for a good two hours I have made headways but it's time for a lunch break and what I'm having for lunch instant ramen for lunch guys like to know me is to know that I love instant ramen so I'm going to just have lunch I don't know what Adam is going to have Adam was this a job anyway i finished organizing everything in my closet so i am just going to show you what i have done so far or well not so far what i have done in its entirety so first let us just look at the drawers and as i said um you guys i had inside of the house clothes in here and then some casual clothes down there what i did was just put all of my inside tops in this drawer so all the tops in here are what i'll be wearing like inside of the house or to the grocery store or just to run errands and stuff and down here are all my dresses and bottoms for inside of the house and running errands and so on as i said i use regular bath soap in the drawers to give the clothes a nice smell and that's it for these two drawers that's what i did for for organizing those and for the casual clothes that were in this drawer that the clothes that i actually wear out like going out getting dressed and all that stuff i put those in the closet so the closet is just one big thing like from that end to that end the door is in the middle unfortunately it's not glass so we have to do it one side at a time 
I do have a sensor light in here so what I did was I put all my work clothing on this side of the closet and then once we get to the other side of the closet down there is where I go casual so of course I organized this to use my sweaters oh my god i know you guys cannot see properly but just bear with me so all of my work cardigans and so on that is the line between my work clothes and my outing clothes the jackets so i have my jackets there and then i go in with pants then i go in with skirts then i go in with dresses then I go in with long sleeve shirts and blouses. Then I go in with the shorter sleeve shirts and blouses. And then at the very end, I have spaghetti strap blouses and like under blouses and stuff. And what I did do is that I kind of color coordinated them. So darks, like from dark to lighter. So as you can see, like black brown, it goes... Um, to the lighter colors at the top so that is it for my work clothes end of the closet behind the clothes i have installed like some nails just to hang my winter jacket um up there because i do not have anywhere else to put them so i just knock some nails <laughs> into the people's closet and hang those up there that's my robe that i wear from time to time and then i have two chest of drawer situation here on top of this one i just have a container where i put my tights and shorts like stuff that i wear under my clothes this basket really replaces the chair so in jamaica or in the black community we have something known as the chair where the clothes inside of it is too dirty to go into the drawers but it is too clean to go into the wash we have a chair for those but i'm not doing a chair i just have a basket there so on these three drawers right here my mic was in the way on these three drawers right here at the top i just have my blouses or spaghetti strap blouses that i wear underneath my clothes so whites and blacks and other colors under there the second drawer i have my bra and bralettes here and then the bottom drawer i have all of my spring and summer and maybe fall kind of pajamas so all of these are very cool very you know not hot and all of those stuff and then I do have a second chest of drawer right here which on the top I have a little container for all my rags I have another one for my Tom Tom hats I'm not even sure what the correct name is but beanies kind of hats there in the first chest of drawer right here I have all of my sweaters this is a very tight drawer because my sweaters are very bulky so I can reach in here for sweaters in the second drawer I have my pants and like skirt and like shorts will also go into this drawer for my outing clothes because of I do not want to hang up my my pants and so on in the actual closet so that's that for this and then in the final one i have all of my winter pajamas so the pants the very thick pants set for the winter cold i keep down here in this one all right so let us move to the other side shall we all right all right so in this side of the closet oh that's what it looks like now guys majority of the clothes i realized because they were folded and in a drawer they all want to be ironed i was not going to iron them today i'll have to do that as a project for another day but um as i said behind there i just have winter sweaters and so on will the light come on inside here yes and then now at the very back i have my church clothes i only have three dresses to go to church that's a shame but it is what it is three dresses for church at the very back and then coming up from here i have all of my going out clothes so clothes that i you know dress up in and so on date night just going out and so forth i start with dresses and i also color coordinated and sleeve coordinate these so all of the longer sleeve clothes are you know at one place and they're also put in color coordination these ones i omitted from color coordination just because they're just too long so i just have to put them to the back but all of these are color coordinated so long sleeve dresses to short sleeve um 
dresses here and then my long sleeve blouses down to my short sleeve blouses you guys i have bought this shirt that says mrs webb from we got married and i have not worn it yet what a shame and look how we did an, an, a photo shoot for our anniversary. I forgot that I had it. My very good Jamaica t-shirt. Yadi fam represent. Yeah, and then as I said, when you reach to my work blazers, that's where work clothes start. Going up that way and then this way is my dressing clothes. Now, here I have a little container for socks. Behind there, I have a container for belts and in that bag right there, I have um, winter stuff, so like scarves and gloves and all of that stuff for winter. And at the top, I don't know if you can see, it's a little dark. At the top, you guys, I do have my handbag. So all of my handbags are up there, handbags and purses and yeah, miscellaneous items up there as well. But yeah, this is what we we have. I thank God I can start wearing my my stuff. I'm very pleased with how everything turned out. I'm glad everything has like its own place and all of that. So I hope you enjoyed this closet organized and clean with me video. I hope it gave you some inspiration to clean out your very own closet because girl, if you did enjoy this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel down below and hit the notification bell to get notified every time I post a video. Until next time, clean your closet! This was a day and a half. My God, no to clean up this house. Bye, guys. <laughs>